Positioned outside two of the newest sporting facilities in Almaty and Astana, synced countdown timers are a constant reminder of the approach of one of the biggest sporting events in Kazakh history, the 7th Asian Winter Games. Our country is the first country in Asia who are organizing the, these Winter Games. Uh, so uh, also the, this image project for Kazakhstan that gives the very big uh, success for us and the power that we are also the sport country in the world. For a country keen to break away from its post-Soviet role as a supplier of natural resources, hosting the Games should give a much-needed boost to the tourism sector, somewhat symbolically in the year that Kazakhstan celebrates the 20th anniversary of its independence. I think the Asian Games, the 7th Asian Winter Games, are very important for Kazakhstan. Firstly, this is an indicator of how the economy in Kazakhstan is developing. Secondly, it's an indicator of political stability in Kazakhstan. It also will draw in tourists who will come to watch the Asian Games. And I think this is a very big event for Kazakhstan. Moreover, previously, the Asian Games were only hosted in South Korea, Japan and China. Held across two major cities, the government has invested $1.5 billion in preparing for the Games, building new sporting facilities and improving the infrastructure, which will cater to around 10,000 extra tourists expected for a week at the end of January. The Asian Winter Games will leave an important legacy in the form of sports facilities. Victory in the Games will also attract more people to the sports. And that is the most important legacy. With state-of-the-art facilities, including the second largest ice skating rink and one of the best ski jumping facilities in the world, Kazakh athletes won't have to travel to expensive European training facilities in the future. Kazakhstan might not be well known internationally for its sporting achievements, but since competing in the Asian Winter Games from 1999, Kazakh athletes have won 92 gold, 95 silver and 129 bronze medals, placing the country fourth in the overall ratings. This time competing on home ground, hopes are high for Kazakhstan to put in a stellar performance. The president himself is a keen sportsman and sees the Games as one of the best ways to garner international attention, raising the country's profile as a tourist destination. Well, we all know that the president initiated the program to improve the health of the nation. The sports bodies are trying to get 30% of the population to actively take part in sport. I think this idea to improve the nation's health is very honourable and we will pursue that. And Kazakhstan's sporting ambitions don't end with a clutch of medals from the Asian Winter Games. After narrowly missing being shortlisted to host the 2014 Winter Olympics, it's hoped a successful showing in January will be a good springboard for future Olympic bids. We prepared everything on the basis of hosting the Olympic Games. For example, in Almaty, we have everything except the bobsleigh track. So there will be a powerful impetus to submit a new application for the Olympic Games. You only have to look at how the Manchester Commonwealth Games paved the way for a successful London 2012 Olympic bid to realise how staging one event can lead to others. And already the International Skiing Federation has decided to hold the 2011 Ski Jump World Cup here. It's not a huge leap to envisage a future Olympics following suit.